हेलो चिल्ड्रेन टुडे वी शैल गो थ्रू लेसन सेवन द इंडियन रेनेसेंस और वी कैन कॉल इट द इंडियन रेनेसा द वर्ड रेनेसेंस स्टैंड फॉर रिबर्थ और रिवाइवल अगर हम भारत के कॉन्टेक्स में बात करते हैं तो इसका अर्थ हुआ भारतीय संस्कृत धर्म एवं मूल्यों के प्रति लोगों को फिर से अवेयर करना Indian Renaissance occurred after the emergence of the British. The impact of western culture on India led to a great awakening in India. Many social reformers came forward and advocated changes in society. Let us know about the contribution of some social reformers. Raja Ram Mohan Roy. He is also called the morning star of renaissance he founded the brahmo samaj in 1828 he opposed child marriage polygamy caste system animal sacrifice and pardha system due to his efforts lord william bentinck banned sati system in 1929 he established english schools the hindu college and the vedanta college ishwar chand vidyasagar he was a great social reformer writer and teacher he strongly opposed polygamy and child marriage in india he advocated widow remarriage due to his efforts the british government agreed to make a law Thus the Widow Remarriage Act was passed by Lord Canning in 1856 AD Dayanand Saraswati he founded the Arya Samaj in 1875 AD he wrote the book Satyarth Prakash the light of truth to maintain the Gurukul system Gurukul Kangri was opened for boys and girls in Haridwar His slogan was back to Vedas. He started Shuddhi movement. Ram Krishna Paramhans. Ram Krishna, a priest, a saint, was a social religious reformer. He believed in the worship of God. His most famous disciple was Swami Vivekananda. Swami Vivekananda The childhood name of Swami Vivekanand was Narendra Nath Dutt. He founded the Ramakrishna Mission in 1896 AD. He represented Hinduism at the Parliament of World's Religions held at Chicago in 1893 AD. He taught humanity, freedom and equality. Sir Syed Ahmed Khan He established the Scientific Society in 1864 AD. He advocated English education for the Muslims. He was against the Pardha system, polygamy and easy divorce which was prevalent among the Muslims. He founded the Anglo-Oriental College in Aligarh for Muslims. which is modern days aligarh muslim university jyotiba phule he founded the satya shodhak samaj in september 1873 ad in maharashtra he worked for the upliftment of lower classes and girls education jyotiba and his wife savitri bai phule started a school for girls at pune Any Besant she founded the Theosophical Society in 1882 in Chennai she also founded Central Hindu High School in Banaras she translated the Bhagavad Gita into English this reveals her belief in the superiority of the Hindu culture so children by these reform movements steps were taken to abolish the social evils and customs of the indian society that's all for today children goodbye